What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to the Division 2. Today I want to talk about a few things that have kind of been mentioned that are being tested within the PTS um, and hopefully these will be coming with the Title 3 update. There's not been a lot of news lately from Ubisoft. Hopefully tomorrow we'll get some new info with the state of the game. But it's kind of been kind of quiet as of late and I don't know, that old saying no news is good news doesn't really apply to me in video games especially when you have a live free service like the Division 2 has. I know I made a video a couple days back kind of discussing is the community getting bored with the game and I think the more news that Ubisoft can put out even if it's stuff that's going to be in the future that's going to be coming out for the game would be the best than not saying anything but here's a few things that might kind of pique your interest that it's going to be coming to the game eventually uh, right now in the PTS they are testing a in-game kind of screen to show up at the end of a mission uh, kind of shows damage dealt, you know, uh, death, skills, all that kind of stuff. And that's kind of reminds me of a lot of MMO style games where at the end you'll see, you know, who dealt the most damage in the lobby, who did the most healing, who did this, who did that. And so kind of overall that will be nice for any kind of mission that you do, especially maybe in the raid when it is released. That should be really nice. But that is something they're testing. No kind of word on when that's coming out. Um, the other thing they talked about is giving rewards for cosmetics, kind of cosmetic rewards in conflict. You would get those every 10 levels. So starting at level 10, 20, 30, and so on to level 99 because that is the max level in conflict. And those are really the only two big things that they have kind of announced. Now, PC did have an update a couple days back that did do some things for loading issues. I kind of wish they would do some kind of loading issue uh, kind of fix on console because sometimes those loading screens are ridiculously long on console. I also there on my PS4 at 10% forever, it seems like. So maybe there's something in the works for console for that that did not mention it. But like I said, this there's not been a lot of stuff going on with the Division 2, but I kind of wanted to just hit on some of these things that have been being talked about by just kind of the community in general, uh, kind of the community in general, other YouTubers and, and whatnot, just kind of discussing what's going on with the game. Because I know if you're like me, you play on console, you don't know exactly what goes on in the PTS. So I figured I'd bring you guys this kind of little bit of update news for some things that may be coming to uh, the Title Three update. I really am interested to see that in-game kind of damage screen, kind of overall how the everyone did in that certain mission. But guys, leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. And of course, if you liked it, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.